yeah okay welcome back to another round of tutorial this time around we're gonna extend what you have been doing so um all what we've been doing is one bar so how do i know it's one bar <clears throat> you see this two black this is one two and this also this brown is one two so all four of them are made up of one bar so we can say it is one bar so whenever you see these two black and these two brown combination combine them together they are one bar so that is what we have been doing all this while so this time around we are taking it up we are expanding it to two bar for the start so uh on a quick recap on what we have done or what we've been doing so this is it you come here and you remember this logic so the first and the last black you select them and you select only the second to the last from the brown so also you do it the same way first of the black and the last of the black then this so don't get it confused and don't get it twisted then we had shika if you remember so just a quick recap then this is the volume we reduce the volume here then remember we had dun dun, so this is it the thumb okay fine that is that was what we've been doing before so now we are taking this to another level so we want to make it two bar now we need to expand it here so just watch carefully once again whatever you see this two these two black two red or two brown rather so whatever color you can call it so that is made up of one bar so whenever I, I expand it i need to make sure i include two bar uh two black and these two brown so to make it two bars so this is one black and this is one brown this is one black again making two and then this is brown so what i do is i over my mouse here to this edge this edge this particular edge then you drag it outside so i make sure it is two black and two brown so that is how we can do it so we are now we have now uh successfully created a two bar loop So if you notice, uh, these are grayed out. They are not showing like this. So what you need to do, whenever you click on anything here, you see they all comes up, and if you delete it, they are gone. So, which means we just open it, we just open them. They are useless because we are not using them. So we need to use them. So this is the topic we want to trick today. So the topic is how to increase from one bar to two bars on channel rack in FL studio so that is how you do it firstly you right click here and you select your uh, fill each form if you can see these are not coming up so you have to do it manually so click every first thing like this so and your uh, the, the, the trick don't forget it the first black and the last black then the third red or brown so the first the last the middle so just like this you have to keep doing it like this so and you will have perfect so you have perfect drumming so you had the shaker like this and you remember your uh what do you call it swing don't forget the swing so to make it sound typical just like an afro beat so this we can have this also so yeah so that's it all right so this is gonna be the end of this tutorial i'll see you on the next video stay tuned